When Neo accidentally separated his mind from his body in Matrix Reloaded, his consciousness was mysteriously trapped in an unknown construct created by one of the Merovingians' henchmen. There he met a peculiar family of programs that could be the key to Matrix 4. Today we're going to talk about the story of Ramakandra, Kamala, and their daughter, Sati. Welcome to Matrix Explained. Welcome to the desert of the real. The first thing that Neo sees upon awakening in Mobile Ave, Mobile being an anagram for Limbo, is a little girl named Sati. She's presented in the foreground, all bright and colorful, like an angel. Sati is the name of a Hindu goddess, but we'll get to that a little later. The little girl directs Neo to her parents, and he recognizes the patriarch. I know you. Yes, in the restaurant of the Frenchman. I am Ramakandra. This is my wife Kamala, my daughter Sati. We are most honored to meet you. Rama, Kamala, and Sati are programs for Machine City. I am the power plant systems manager for recycling operations. My wife is an interactive software programmer. She is highly creative. The recycling part of Rama's job description could refer to something that the machines do to humans in the real world. He could be in charge of what Morpheus once described as liquefying the dead to feed the living. And then I saw the fields with my own eyes. Watched them liquefy the dead so they could be fed intravenously to the living. But since everything in the Matrix has multiple meanings, Rama is also the name of a Hindu deity. Part of his story is described as follows. Though born in a royal family, their life is described in the Hindu text as one challenged by unexpected changes, such as an exile into impoverished and difficult circumstances, ethical questions, and moral dilemma. Rama's life and comments emphasizes that one must pursue and live life fully, that all three life aims are equally important, virtue, desires, and legitimate acquisition of wealth. Rama also adds that one must also introspect and never neglect what one's proper duties, appropriate responsibilities, true interests, and legitimate pleasures are. After studying the symbolic and religious origins of Ramakandra, we can see why the Wachowskis chose this name for the character, which is linked to karma and reincarnation. Perhaps this is why Rama calls himself the Recycling Operations Manager. It is a modern way of saying managing reincarnations. Ranma, the deity, had to face many conflicts during his exile and had to prioritize responsibilities. Rama Khandra from the Matrix fought for the safety of his daughter. My wife is an interactive software programmer. She is highly creative. Based on Rama's introduction, we could assume that Kamala's job is to program certain aspects of the Matrix so its inhabitants can interact with them. The fact that Kamala is a programmer explains Sati's birth. Sati is the creation of Kamala and Rama, a program that resulted from the combination of two other programs. Kamala is another name for the Hindu deity Lakshmi, the goddess who leads to one's goals. She is the goddess of wealth, fortune, love, beauty, joy, and prosperity. Her name is derived from the Sanskrit root words for knowing the goal and understanding the objective. This is why Kamala is so direct with Neo. She understands the purpose of the anomaly and the purpose of what Neo must do. She feared that if the train man found out that they were talking to Neo, he would leave them all trapped in Mobile Ave. Knowing all of this, we can trace the origins of this family to Hinduism. Rama Khandra, a program from Machine City, he and Kamala are Matrix programs who fell in love and that union brought the creation of Sati. The issue with Sati is that she was created by programs, not by the machines. She was born without a purpose or function that could benefit the Matrix. Every program that exists in the Matrix needs a purpose or function. Sati is perhaps the first program that was needlessly created. This makes her the most human program ever created in Machine City, and that is why she is special. Rama and Kamala became exiles, abandoning their purpose for the love of their daughter. 
Interesting that this is the first time that the Matrix is looked at as a refuge instead of a prison. Humans fight to escape from the simulation, but Rama was willing to do whatever he could to ensure that Sati was transported and hidden inside the Matrix, even if that meant betraying a friend and making a deal with the devil. Rama Khandra was at the Merovingian's restaurant negotiating Sati's transportation to the Matrix. In exchange for Sati's safe transportation, Rama will give the Merovingian the termination code of the Oracle's shell. Can you tell me what happened to you? Two programs that I trusted sold the termination code of my original shell to the Merovingian. Why did they do that? For love. For the life of their child. You knew about it and yet you let it happen? I had to. Why? Because the child is important. I can't tell you why, but I believe that one day, the child will change both our world and your world forever. The Oracle was willing to sacrifice her shell for Sati, but this selfless act of sacrifice was possibly planned by the Oracle herself. After all, Sati is seen with the Oracle in Matrix Revolutions. Rama and Kamala did betray the Oracle by giving the termination code to the Merovingian Yet it is the Oracle who ends up protecting Sati. After Rama and Kamala managed to sneak Sati into the Matrix, they disappeared. Their whereabouts are unknown. We don't know if they were caught by the agents or if they returned to their respective jobs. Did they willingly leave Sati with the Oracle or were they forced, driven by guilt for betraying their friend? Perhaps the Oracle offered to protect the girl and promised the parents that she would find a purpose but only if Sati stays with her. Sati will later be assimilated by Agent Smith, and after he was destroyed, Sati awakens on the ground next to the deja vu cat. We've theorized that perhaps part of the anomaly's code that was embedded in Agent Smith was passed on to Sati, giving her incredible abilities and perhaps endowing her with a purpose. Sati created a beautiful sunrise inside the Matrix. She had become a programmer like her mother Kamala, However, her ability is not limited to creating interactive programs. Sati can modify the Matrix code. And this is the story of Sati's family. Sati possibly being the first program born out of love and without purpose, but who may perhaps be one of the most powerful and human-like programs in the Matrix. The Oracle said that Sati will one day change the Matrix and the real world. She told that little girl that they will see Neo again. So it is easy to imagine that the next story in the Matrix saga may focus on the program that was born out of love, not out of necessity. How Sati may change the real world and the simulated world in Matrix 4, a program that was named after a goddess who sacrificed herself after the loss of her husband. But do you agree? Why did Rama and Kamala leave Sati in the care of the Oracle? Is Sati going to change both worlds in Matrix 4? For Matrix Explained, please leave a like and subscribe. And thank you for visiting the Desert of the Real.